It should be no surprise to you guys that I'm not a religious person, and honestly, I think I'm a better person because of it. I'm able to live freely, untethered by the so-called laws and sins constructed by power-hungry megalomaniacs. But there's one question that I can't really seem to recall being asked, but I'm sure that other people have asked this question to one another, and I've actually pondered this little thought myself, and that is, do you think religion will ever go away? I've been pondering this subject for a little while now. I've looked at other videos of other non-religious folk, and the results have been pretty much split down the edge. Some people say that religion will, in fact, one day die off, and others say that it's here to stay, and there's really nothing we can do about it. But I, let me be so bold as to make the argument that it's actually both. The reason why I say that is because throughout history, people have always, and will always, want to search for their meaning of existence. They want to understand why they're here. And organizations such as religion have always stepped in to provide a sort of answer and try to convince people fickle enough to join their creed of preset philosophies. It's been that way since the beginning of civilization, and unfortunately we haven't evolved enough to go beyond that need. But that's not to say that certain religions in particular will never die out. That is entirely possible. I mean, people have been worshipping various forms of gods and deities for thousands of years that have long since been regarded as simple myth or legend. It's kind of a relief, too, because certain religions in particular are very violent and very savage. I mean, you wouldn't, have, you wouldn't want to have a congregation of people perform a live sacrifice of people tearing out each other's hearts and eating it raw to appease the sun gods in the middle of Times Square now, would you? I mean, people... I mean, back in the day, the Greeks and the ancient Egyptians regarded their gods as truth, and now they've been, and now they're regarded as as primitive, violent, and mystical fairy tales. What's to stop the religions of today from being the same thing thousands of years from now? The answer: nothing, really. That can happen. It probably will happen largely thanks to the internet and the advent and continuous meteoric rise of atheism. But is that enough to destroy religion altogether? I don't think so. And I'm sorry to act all cynical and pessimistic here, but I'm, I'm looking at it at a realistic note. You see, like I said before, there are always going to be people who want to look for a higher power, and there are going to be people who are going to take advantage of those people. And that, in my mind, is never going to change. It might get smaller, it might get weaker, but it'll never completely disappear. I think in the best case, the best case scenario possible, that religion will lose its foothold enough to be removed from power so that a new secular society can arise and just and just continue and just make the world a better place that way because there are always going to be little cults little sections and just otherwise just groups of people who believe in ridiculous shit and sometimes and who knows the religions that religions today will probably be replaced by even crazier kookier religions tomorrow i mean Scientology's relatively uh, a relatively recently formed religion. And just look at that. Look at that. It's still rising. And just the legend in itself is completely ridiculous. And people buy that shit. It's, it's amazing on what people will perceive as true. So until then, my fellow non-believers, the only advice or philosophy that I can give is just be cool. Just take it one day at a time. You have your beliefs, and they're not going to change, more than likely at least. So just be free. Live for yourself. Live for the people you love. Just be as good as possible, and just strive to make things better for you, for others, for the entire world. No matter what they believe in, or who they believe in, just do it out of the kindness of humanity, and just do it, just do it for other people. I'm PM Rants, and I can't really come up with anything clever to say here for the outro, so I'm just gonna say be cool and peace.
No text messages, of course. You're still watching this? The video's over, you can go now. Fine, you can just stay here and watch me stare at you. I really don't think green is a good color for me anyway, but I like it's always sunny in Philadelphia, so. I may wear it because of that to represent. Hey, if you like comedy sketches, feel free to check out our film channel, Catharsis Pictures. We make some relatively funny stuff, so if you're into that kind of stuff, check it out. Also, Aaron, my roommate, has his own channel out now. So if you're looking for some more raw, insightful rants than mine, his is the place to go. Thank you for watching.